Girl, I done forgot what I said. Girl, my man didn't call me. <laughs> that you guys have gifted me through the registry. Like, oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. All oh, these are gonna be so freaking cute. Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. Or welcome if this is your first time coming across my channel. It has been forever and a day since I did a video, you guys. I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> but I am back today with a new video and hopefully I'll have the energy to keep it up. <laughs> so today is going to be another vlog. Also, this video is in partnership with Factor. So if you wanna see what I get into today at 31 weeks pregnant, stay tuned. So I did want to show you guys my current bump and also I will be having other videos that I just haven't edited yet that's going to come out after this that I was not as far along. So I just wanted to say that really quick because I think I have one like at 23 weeks or something like that or 25 weeks or something <laughs> and I didn't get a chance to get the video out to you guys so just FYI. But today I am actually 31 weeks pregnant and this is what I am looking like. Woo, big mama. Okay, big mama can't wait. <laughs> I'll be so tired, you guys. I'll be so tired. But I'm so happy that my baby girl is doing well. And yeah, you guys, third trimester in full effect. And hopefully I'll have a what's that called like a, a second trimester recap coming up soon okay on another note my house is a mess now this box here is all of your stuff that i haven't got a chance to show you yet that you guys have gifted me through the registry like oh my gosh oh my gosh like i am so thankful so grateful like god i love you guys so much and i appreciate you guys so much so i'm gonna show you what you guys have picked up for baby girl so far over here is items that my friends and family have gotten so far y'all i got more stuff coming i barely can open the door i'm like i gotta get my life together i feel so overwhelmed like you guys do not even know how overwhelmed i feel i feel like i need to get the nursery together i need to unpack all this stuff get it all together baby shower i mean it's the baby shower ain't even happened yet it's just a lot it's a lot oh my gosh and i just don't feel like i have my house how i normally have it it's normally really tidy and it's just girl i can't do it i'm so tired <laughs> but before we get into any gifts or anything like that one of you had asked for me to talk about my trying to conceive journey so i thought why not start the vlog with that um it isn't like a really long journey or anything like that but um some people aren't interested and there were products that i did feel helped us so if i could help someone else then yeah i would love that okay so in my first trimester recap video i did mention that it took us about four to five months to conceive and then just the ups and downs with that um you know having times where i really felt like i was pregnant and i wasn't and um you know just some of the letdowns that i had and then um when we did finally conceive but i didn't go really in much detail um as to when i did actually conceive and you know the things that we used and all that stuff to help us with that so this is specifically for whoever asked i can't remember i think i'll put the um comment somewhere in the video if i can find it and yeah this is for you and anybody else that's interested so okay so again it took us about four or five months and we also have 
um, friends of ours that are trying to conceive as well. Um, and they told us about these two products. First, before we even started the products, we were just basically using the um, My Calendar app that shows, you know, your ovulation day, um, you know, your most uh, fertile day and all of that, and then trying accordingly. Um, Hello? Yeah, I did get some rice. But I had took out the, the, the chicken quarters because I was going to try to make some curry chicken. I was going to try to surprise you, but... Oh, okay. I know, but it's frozen solid. The other one, I already had took it out to thaw, so I don't know. I'll take it out, but I don't, I don't know how to do no pork. I'll help you with the other part, like the cutting up the seasonings and stuff. You want me to do that? Cause I'm not gonna cut that big chunk of pork. I don't want to. Okay, but I'll see when you get up. <laughs> All right, bye. Love you, girl. I forgot what I said. Girl, my man didn't call me. <laughs> no. Um. So what was I saying? Oh, okay. So yeah, we were just using the My Calendar app. And that tracks your period and you know ovulation and all of that stuff so i have been using that app pretty much for years anyway to just track my period so um fast forward um i think we had tried for like the first two months and we hadn't gotten pregnant yet or something like that and then we started talking to the other couple and they were like, you know what? Well, actually, Bay, he was talking to his friend and um, he was like, oh, well, you know, I'm using this, this and that. They sent the screenshots and we were like, okay, we're gonna try it out. So the first product was, it's, I think I couldn't find it. I tried to find the physical product, but the first product was called, I think, Fertility Aid. And it's like a daily pill that the men take to help their sperm be stronger or, you know, swim faster. I don't know. But it's supposed to just help you in general, help your reproductive, you know, everything reproductive for men. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so it, it was a lot of people on Amazon saying that, you know, let's just say they had low sperm count. And we didn't know if that was the case, but maybe we just wanted to just try our options. So um let's say that they got it measured and after that um after they took it up for a month or whatever they showed that their numbers had either doubled or you know went up a third or whatever so um it was supposed to increase sperm count and then this you know also um you know improve the quality of your sperm so that was a daily pill that bay was supposed to be taking now I don't know if that's all men, but my man, girl, he wasn't taking it like he was supposed to. I'm like, um, did you take the pill? He like, oh man, I forgot. Oh, uh, no, I'm gonna take it today. I'm, uh, no, I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. Girl, every minute he's just supposed to be taking it, ain't taking nothing. So, I wouldn't, I don't know if it really helped. Maybe the little bit that he did take, it did help. I'm not sure, but he was not taking it consistently. But I will say from the other couple and then also the Amazon reviews, it did, um, you know, potentially work. So I will put a screenshot if I haven't already on the side so you guys can see. I'll also link it down below. And then this is what I do feel helped which when i first heard of the, the product i'm like how is that supposed to help but it's called pre-seed fertility lubricant this is what it looks like i think it was like 30 something bucks and this is from the makers of first response so it says for use by couples when trying to conceive, clinically tested, help support sperm quality. Okay, so it was my understanding that this product helps, cause I was like, how can a lubricant like really do anything? 
So it was my understanding that this lubricant helps to, I don't know, like push the sperm further along, help them along their journey, get there um, more effectively. Um, and they were saying like non-sperm friendly um, lubricants, they basically could, I don't know, kill the sperm or they just really don't do anything for you. Okay, so it comes in this tube and it comes with several applicators. I don't wanna open it or whatever. Wait, this one that has one open? Okay, okay, there, this one has one of these. Cause there's three in each one of these. So <clears throat> this is what it looks like. The applicator. And basically you hook this up to here and you put, you fill it up to where I guess it recommends. I can't remember exactly how it worked, but you, you basically push the, the lube in there and then you insert it before you have um, intercourse. Now we have been, of course, having sex on our ovulation, you know, days, um, the most fertile days and all of that, and we hadn't had any success. So this one particular time, I ended up having um, that cervical mucus or whatever you call it. Like, have you guys ever like wiped after your period and you have like that clear jelly type of thing? So um, I heard that that was the most fertile, your most fertile time, right? So, but when I looked on the app, <laughs> It said that my fertile stage had already passed. So I was like, hmm, I'm like, it's saying that I'm not fertile no more. The chance of getting pregnant is slim or low or whatever. But then also I just remember hearing that when you see that, then you are the most fertile. So I say, you know what, let's just try. Let's just try and let's also use this at the same time. So we use this, we tried on the day that I saw it. And girl, that's when I got pregnant. That is when I got pregnant. The next month, I was like, wait a minute, I'm a, I'm a day late. I'm like, okay, I ain't gonna get too excited. I ain't gonna get too excited. I'm, I'm gonna just chill out two days late. I'm like, oh, wait a minute now. Wait a minute now. I know this stuff didn't work now. I think that it was um, a combination between this, stuff and then also going with seeing the um you know seeing the clear jelly like discharge and not going by the ovulation thing i mean and you would think that there is right on point especially since i had been using it for years it you know whatever but it was off it was slightly off so i mean i would say my rec my recommendation if you are trying to conceive maybe try to you know have intercourse a couple days after they say that you're not fertile anymore or whatever or in a couple days before you know if you can um and then also try this out you know try it out see if it works for you and also see if the other the fertility aid works for um your man as well so Yes, you guys, that is my pretty much journey on trying to conceive. Again, I can't remember, it was either four or five months. I know it was before six months because, you know, at six months I was considering like, okay, maybe I should, you know, go see someone or go see a specialist if we haven't gotten pregnant by the six month mark. So I know that it was before then. So yes, that is what I believe helped us to conceive. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that little chit chat. I'm hungry. I'm about to eat, girl. It's 4.30 and he wants, I just put my foot in my mouth, say I'm gonna make some curry. And Lord, no, I really didn't want to do it, but <laughs> I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna get something to eat and then I'm gonna show you guys your gifts. All right, y'all, so my factor box just came in the mail. And y'all, I cannot tell you how much of a convenience it is to have a factor subscription because it's days I just, I don't wanna cook. Um, I just want something really quick. And I know that it's nutritious. I know it tastes good. They're owned by the same company as Green Chef. So you know Green Chef be popping. So you know their meals are good. <laughs> so I really do enjoy factor. 
You can use it just for your regular meals, you know, on the go. Or if you're trying to lose weight and you want to do like calorie control, they're calorie smart, they have keto meals, all kinds of stuff. If this is your first time hearing of them, here's a little bit more about them. Factor makes meeting your nutrition goals easier than ever by delivering fresh, never frozen, dietitian approved meals right to your doorstep. Their team of gourmet chefs create each meal using only ingredients with integrity to help you feel your best all day long. This June, give Factor and enjoy eating well without the hassle. Simply choose your meals and enjoy fresh, flavor-packed meals delivered to your door. Ready in just two minutes with no prep and no mess. This is what I personally love about Factor because not every day I feel like searching my fridge to see what I could eat, especially now that I'm pregnant. Factor meals are easy for me to grab and go or something when I just don't feel like cooking and that's a win-win for me. Factor could also help you save money. If you want to budget this month by cutting back on takeout, get Factor instead. Not only is Factor cheaper than takeout, but meals are ready faster than restaurant delivery in just minutes. So I definitely recommend for you guys to check out Factor. Head to factor75.com or click the link below and use code for show 50 to get 50% off your first Factor box. So yes, you guys, that is Factor again. I cannot stress it enough. I definitely recommend them. I will leave the link in the description box below for you guys. And yeah, let's go ahead and get into some food because I'm so hungry. I was looking at this shrimp fajitas, which I've never had, this bottom one. And I think that is what I'm going to have. I'm going to have that with one of these smoothies because it looks so dang on good. And y'all, I think I'm going to make a burrito out of this. If I'm being honest, <laughs> um, this is the low carb version. So it is, um, let me see. This is the shrimp fajitas with poblamo cauliflower rice and cilantro lime crema. It's 490 calories. And yeah, so you can eat it as is, of course. And it only has eight net carbs. So eight net carbs for this entire tray. Um, but I'm going to go ahead Either I'm going to have tortilla on the side and kind of scoop everything up with it, or I'm going to make it into, into a little burrito. So, yes, you guys, that is what I'm warming up right now. I'm going to eat, and then I'm going to show you guys my registry gifts that you got me. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. I love y'all. Okay, guys. So here is our shrimp fajitas with our colorful with our cauliflower rice. I got my tortilla here. I also got my crema that I'm gonna put on later. Okay, quick taste test. So shrimp and fajita veggies. Mmm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. See, and what I like is the fact that you're not stingy with the shrimp. The shrimp are a nice size. They're nice and meaty. They taste good. Cauliflower rice. Tastes like cauliflower, <laughs> but it is good. I would give this meal like an 8.5 out of 10. Again, once I put that tortilla and the crema on there, I didn't even put that on there. Bomb, bomb, bomb. And the shrimp are big and premium so good so yes you guys i'm gonna go ahead and eat this i'm gonna watch a little bit of hollywood divas oh my gosh it's like an old show but um i like it i just found it on i don't know if it was tubi or something 
But girl, I've been watching this show that's like 10 years old. <laughs> I don't even know if it's still running or what's going on, but I like it so far. So anyway, I'm about to watch a little bit of that and then I'll come back and show you guys the gift. Oh, I'm getting started on dinner. Cause Bay's over there pressuring me. He's like, yeah, you ain't started cooking yet. I'm like, no, I'm so, I still got stuff to do. And he's like, man, I'm hungry. He, so I'm like, okay, let me just start the rice. I'm going to do the haul and then finish up dinner. But I'm just starting some white rice right now. And that is it. Hopefully I can, rem oh, hopefully I can remember how to make curry. Okay, so this one came gift wrapped. It says, enjoy your gift from Marvette. Thank you, Marvette. Let's see what we have here. Hold on now. Oh my goodness. All oh, these are gonna be so freaking cute. Okay, so, oh my God, there's a ton of them in here. I didn't realize. Look at this for a little honey, sweetie. It's a little mini hanger and it's really cute blush color. They're velvet hangers and I believe this comes in a 50 pack. So if I'm not mistaken, if my memory serves me correct, she got the hangers and then also the, the size dividers. So they should be in here somewhere. I might have everything kind of out of order, but I wanna say she got these together, kind of like a set with the size dividers and these really cute hangers. Oh, I can't wait to hang up her little outfits in this and get the nursery, you know, together. So thank you so much, Marvette. These are really gonna come in handy and they're aesthetically pleasing. They're super, super cute. <laughs> So, our next gift is, also is two of three. Okay, so forgive me if I kind of have things out of order because you guys see I'm in the middle of chaos here, so I'm just trying. Um, this one, it says two, two of three, and I believe this is from, this is from Stacy B. Thank you so much, Stacy. Okay, so, this, I'm not sure if this was on my registry. I did give an option, like if you wanted to buy something else that wasn't on the registry, you could do that and then still send it to me. So I don't know exactly how that works, <laughs> but Stacy then figured it out because I don't remember having this, but I'm so happy that I do. It's a super cute, let me see if I can get it to focus flamingo towel set so yes it's one of those really cute hooded towels and this pretty white and like pink flamingo color and then it also has some extra washcloths here so thank you so much stacy and then we'll find the rest of your gifts in here mm, oh so cute so, so cute honey oh sweetie pie honey bun okay so this one did come with a note it says congratulations tiffany once again on your beautiful baby girl may the most high god bless continue to bless you and your family abundantly with health wealth love divine protection and guidance blessings from leslie oh my gosh leslie thank you girl mm, that's so sweet thank you leslie so leslie got my first bottle set i think i put two bottle sets on there so she purchased the Tommy Tippy one. This is the advanced anti-colic one. And I really, really needed this and wanted this. This is actually the only bottles that I have so far. So thank you again, Leslie. And the reviews on this was absolutely great. It says it's designed to um, like reduce gas. 85% of babies experience less colic. So this is definitely gonna come in handy and Thank you so much, girl. Okay, so this is the second gift from Stacy. So remember, she also got the hooded towel and she also, everything is for like bath and sleep time. Oh my goodness. Okay, so this is the Johnson's Sleepy Baby gift set. 
Okay, so this comes with the Johnson's Calming Shampoo, the Bedtime Lotion, and then also the Bedtime Bath. And it's purple because of the lavender scent, which helps the baby fall asleep. And yeah, I heard great things about it. So, um, of course, I've used regular Johnson & Johnson like that. I've never really used the Bedtime. So, it'll be interesting to see if it does actually help um, the baby fall asleep faster. So thank you, Stacey. Okay, so this is the second gift from Marvette. Remember she um, gave the velvet hangers and then also, like I said, I, I thought I remember correctly. These are the, it's a seven piece double-sided closet dividers. Oh, sweetie pie. Oh. Okay, I gotta get my life organized so I can use these pronto. Look at this. Come on in. So it shows like the three to six months and I can divide up her little outfit. On the other side, we have zero to three months and then it goes all the way up to I believe the 24 months. So it's newborn to 24 months. And yes, these are just gonna help me be organized with her nursery and just her clothing, way more organized than her mama is because girl, my clothes is all over the place. And speaking of my clothes, as part of my organization, I have put all the clothes to the side that I want to actually sell. Um, so I'll be doing a closet sale soon. Girl, half that stuff I probably can't even fit. You know what I'm saying? But I mean, I could probably, you know, once I have a baby, but girl, I pulled up a few of those things. I'm like, I was wearing this, like this, this looks so tiny. <laughs> so yeah, um, so I'll be having a closet sale soon. And yes, this is the key baby girl, nice and organized. So thank you, Marvette. Wait, let me go check my rights, y'all. Hold on, hold on. Oh. Yes, finally. Y'all remember, it was, ja it was Jamie, or was it? Yes, it was Jamie. Remember our last haul, I did not have Jamie's gift, and I didn't know where Jamie's gift was, so I did find it. And look at this for little honey, sweetie. <laughs> Look at this little cute plush toy. And it has the little binky um, attached to it. Super soft and cute. When I saw this, I just fell in love with it. And I wanted baby girl to have it. So yes, it's this really cute plush toy with the attached binky so that she can hold on to it. Oh my God. So cute, so cute, honey. Thank you, Jamie. And then she also got her some more binkies. These are the, I believe it's pronounced mom or ma'am. Um, but I heard that these were really good. They had some really good reviews. So we're definitely gonna test these out and hopefully they work well for her and that she likes them. Yes, this is zero to six months. And again, thank you so much, girly. So this says, enjoy your gift. Can't wait to see baby girl. Many blessings to you and your spouse and your new bundle of joy from Amber. Thank you. Girl, I'll show you a whole government name. Thank you so much, Amber. Again, I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So she did get some, the OG Johnson & Johnson lotion. And y'all know, oh my God, that baby smell all up under their neck, all in their roll, sweetie, with the little lotion. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. <laughs> so yes, we got that. And then some much needed, um, this is the butt paste for like diaper rash and stuff like that. This is a definite necessity. So thank you so much, Amber. Girl, Marvette sent another gift. Girl, I didn't even see this. Okay, I don't know, I don't know if I thought, I don't know what I thought, but thank you so much, Marvette. This is from 
this is from our bag. <laughs> I was about to say it again. She got me this stroller fan, or I don't even know if you want to call it a stro stroller fan. I seen it, you know, advertised kind of like a stroller fan, like on TikTok and stuff. And a lot of moms were talking about it, especially if you have like a summer baby, like I'm gonna have, it's gonna be um, the hottest month <laughs> when I have her. So, you know, I was thinking like if I would take a walk or do anything like that, I definitely wanna have a portable fan to, you know, just cool her down and it's not too hot for her. So, or maybe even, you know, if she's in the bassinet next to me or something and it's hot or whatever, I could put the fan and attach it to it. So, you know, so that she's cooled down. So yes, a portable fan. Thank you so much. I appreciate it, Marvette. Okay, we almost at the end. And I'm gonna show you one more thing. I'm gonna finish this dinner and I'm on a bed. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? I'm on a bed early. So this is the last gift from Stacy. Remember she got all the bath, bath stuff, the, um, the bath hoodie towel and then also the nighttime set so this is the last thing from her which is the baby's tub so this is the first year's um sure comfort tub this is from birth to 25 pounds so this should last me a long while this also had some really good reviews as well so Thank you so much, Stacy. I appreciate it. Look, the baby gonna be clean, smelling like lavender, and ready to go to bed, okay? <laughs> so I appreciate it so much. Thank you again. Y'all, I just wanna thank you so, so, so much for just helping me with everything. Y'all, you do not understand how appreciative I am. I appreciate you guys so much all my internet aunties for people that you know just send their prayers their well wishes their love their gifts y'all i appreciate it so much i don't even know how many times i can say it but i really truly do because you know you don't have to spend your hard earned money to help me and you choose to do that and that just means so girl that just means a lot to me so thank you so much i appreciate it <laughs> And the last thing that I wanted to show you guys was um, the baby registry thing. So when you register with Amazon, they'll give you um, a welcome gift. So I would like to I'm do my welcome gift. And the only thing you really have to do is make sure you complete at least 60% of your registry. So they give you like a checklist to make sure that you you know, get the necessities like your stroller, your high chair, your your crib, your crib mattress, stuff like that. So as long as you complete 60% of it, they will um, send you out this welcome gift. So this is from the actual registry. So you don't know exactly what you're getting. So I just want to share with you guys what I got. You know what, I'm not exactly sure of what this is. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. It says, it's a sposy and it says for life's little messes. It looks like a pad, but I'm gonna have to look up and see what this is, but this is the brand. So the next thing is this two in wash, two in one wash shampoo and cleansing gel from Vivi. Okay, so this is some Infamil Strong Bones supplements. It's for zero to 12 months. And this is some vitamin D drops for the baby. Oh, nice. Okay, so these are some organic women multivitamin gummies. And I'm pretty sure this is like kind of postnatal type of situation going on. So that's really nice. I'm happy to have that. So it has um, B6, vitamin E, vitamin D, and yeah. Also got a little sample of some Aquaphor. You can use that for the baby rash and stuff like that. This is really nice of them to do this. Some like on the go wipes, a little sample of that. Oh, they gave us Swaddle Me Swaddle. This is the original Swaddle, I guess. It shows you on the back how to swaddle the baby and everything else. Nice. Oh, it's a onesie. <laughs> oh, 
poor little baby with um, a hippo on it, lion and elephant. Super cute, it's a Carter's onesie. You know what this kind of reminds me of? Like those sample boxes or those boxes that you get with subscriptions and stuff. It just has a whole bunch of random things, which is cool. Oh, so I guess if you don't want to use the cream, this is a diaper rash spray. Or maybe you can use it kind of like on the go, on the go. If you don't have to, you know, deal with the mess of a cream, you could just spray it. And that's pretty convenient. So I've never actually even seen that before. So nice. Okay, and then our last two things are these breastfeeding storage bags and disposable pads. So it has a two samples of each one of the, of the storage bags and then also of the nursing pads. I actually don't have any nursing pads, which I need to pick up from a hospital bag. I need to pick up a few things like a nursing bra and what I'm gonna wear and all of that jazz. So yes, you guys, I gotta get my hospital bag together. Let me know if you guys would be interested in seeing that. And then the last thing is this. So it's the anti-colic um, bottle as well as a pacifier. So yes, you guys, if you do have a baby on the way and you're watching this because you are expecting, um, definitely if you register with Amazon, get your welcome bag. Pretty nice stuff for free just for registering with Amazon. So I'll leave the link below for that as well. And yes, you guys, I just want to thank you again so much and I'm not gonna go too much into it before I get all choked up again but thank you again so much I appreciate you guys I love you guys so so much and let me make this man some food because girl he called me tomorrow you ain't started yet you ain't start no I ain't started yet I'm doing stuff dang <laughs> and girl it's every time I make a Jamaican meal it just gives me anxiety because I always feel like I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know if he makes me feel like I don't know what I'm doing, but because he's normally the one that cooks it, so he be all like, you know, extra tasting it, like, mm. oh yeah, okay, you did it. I'm like, boy, I don't need your approval. You gonna eat it or no? Like, what you gonna do? Cause I mean, I could just not make that. <laughs> so yeah, rice is done. I'm, I'm not gonna show the whole process. I think I've already showed it before. I showed him do it. I'm just probably gonna show just a little bit. But yeah, let me go ahead and cook this dinner, girl. Okay, you guys. So I've seasoned up the chicken, but Bay already came home, so it seems like he's about to take over. And I'm just gonna. I ain't taking over. I'm just yeah. Don't talk. He fully about to take over. So I don't care what he talking about. I done did. What you I, done about? <laughs> I done chopped up the meat and seasoned it up. And I'm about to cut up the seasons and stuff. I tile. I tile. <laughs> Burning the curry. Huh? What? He's scared. Mm. <laughs> What can I do? It's so loving and gentle to the core. What can I do when you fill me with happiness and much more? What can I do? It's so stunning. I just can't look away. What can I do? I should know by now you make my day. Never more will dreams expire. our finished curry i i got all boneless pieces and so did trenton babe like the pieces with the bone in it so he's making his plate he ended up finishing up everything for me and i'm so happy because i was tired i was tired but i cried huh but i cried <laughs> i would have cried you cried yes i would have rest of chili 
Thanks, Dave. You're welcome. Eat some of Shelly rice. No, man, eat some of Tiffany rice. <laughs> so, anyway, you guys, this is my plate. And yeah, that'll conclude today's vlog. We're just going to chill, probably watch a movie. And. Want to watch? Um, um, what's that I want to watch? The Incredibles. I guess we're watching The Incredibles too. <laughs> okay, loves, that concludes today's video. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed filming it for you. And if you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Be sure to check out Factor in the description box below. And until my next video, have a blessed day, have a blessed week, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye. Ceiling fan blowing cold breeze on your body I can't tell you really what it is but you got it Make up in the morning you got dresses in your closet But you grab them tight you in love with being modest You a mood body giving interviews I'm just saying I'm a mute But you ain't even flexing